Welcome back to um, Big Fat Man. He looks like Mr. Mustard. Who? He From does. Cluedo. From Cluedo. Oh my god, he does. Well, depending on the, what type of Cluedo you play, all the characters look different in every Cluedo. Time. But like the, the, original the original, yeah, no, the original, yeah, he looks like Mr. Mustard. He's dressed like him as well, but yeah. Yeah, and I made one of the thumbnails, Mr. Mustard. Yeah, I need I need to make thumbnails. That's what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I'm sorry, I didn't make them for the last one. I'll I upload, had to buy suits. I'll do two of them. Two thumbnails. Two of them. How I've been doing them, and then you do. How many thumbnails do you reckon you can do? Oh fuck, they're easy. I just you just go to Photoshop. I'll do this first one then. As yeah, do the how first, I normally yeah, do it. Yeah, you do, do the, the rest yeah, do, of them. You yeah, do the first one, then just don't post the second one until later in Sunday. I love how people are now hearing us planning on doing thumbnails and all that. Yep. We could, you scratched at the door. No, Come he on. didn't. Wow, okay. He didn't touch it. I swear he did. <laughs> he did. Uh, me and Alec have been hearing it for so long, now we just oh. hear it. <laughs> We're going mental up in this bitch. Anyway. How do we begin? Shall we continue? If you guys... you guys yeah, are. what up? Give me. There's not much in it. I don't care. In case you guys are catching up and you guys haven't watched the last episodes, what are you doing? Um, the fuck, man. Basically, um, Mr. Red is basically the murderer. We know this because of the start, and now we're just trying to make sure that he gets found guilty. I thought you'd finish it. Huh? I thought you'd finish it. <laughs> anyway. So you continue then. So, you noticed. How can I not? I suppose I should have guessed you would. It is a large painting. <clears throat> Mr. Grossberg, I know you and Mr. White are connected somehow. C connected, you say? Yes. And I know what it is. He's blackmailing you. <laughs> Your lover. Your lovers! <laughs> I know, because Mr. White is <laughs> rather gay. <laughs> <laughs> Your lovers. Mr. White has something on you, doesn't he? Blackmail. I think my painting is fairly gaudy proof. Ugh. Ugh. Very well. This may be the chance I've been waiting for. Ugh. Maybe it's time to get this off my chest so I can finally rest easy oh. again. After all, you were me as understudy. Perhaps it was fate? What's he talking about? Red White is a man who makes his living through intimidation. Blue Corp is a company that excels in finding people's weaknesses, I'm afraid. I've been playing. I've been paying them for fifteen years now. Fifteen years. All because of the DL six incident, as you may have guessed. Name on the back of those photographs. As you suspected, I could not stand in defense of Maya because of this. White would have destroyed me if I did. So that's the connection. It is hard for me to tell you this, my boy, but arresting Red White will be nigh on impossible. Impossible? Why? He has information on everyone. It gives him an iron grip. <laughs> he owns judges, attorneys, prosecutors, police, and politicians. What? They are bound, unable to do harm to themselves and therefore to him. Don't look at me like that. What do you see is nothing more than the weight of many years. Many years of me eating anything. <laughs> Deal success. What is the DL6 incident? DL6 is nothing more than the sorting code the police gave the case. It was 15 years ago now. I received a request from a medium, a spirit medium. A medium? Her name was Misty Fay. So we've got, hold on. Mia, Maya, Misty. And May. And May, yep. This is just like Elden Ring. <laughs> Fay. Did you also know the voice actress of um, Jesse and Misty died earlier this year? Yep. That was very sad. I only, know, I only found out of today. It shot in August. Okay. Indeed, she was Mia's mother. She had been investigating a murder at the bequest of the police. And she failed. As a result, the police called her a fraud. That's what Maya was talking about the other day. I did all I could for her and in the end, cleared her of wrongdoing. That murder case, however, remains unsolved to this day. That case is the DL6 incident. Bonk. But why were you blackmailed over this, Mr. Grossberg? The DL6 incident was top secret at the time. 
It made sense. The police didn't want people to know they were using a medium. They couldn't let people know. But one person found out. I... I told him. You told White? He offered me riches. It is an embarrassment to me now. Because I talked, the police were mocked far and wide. In secret, they began looking for the one who sold them out. Of course, White heard about it, and he came to me. Only this time, the offer was blackmail. I see. White controls the law of this country as he sees fit. Yet if you would still challenge him, have a close look at Mia's office. Mia's office? She followed his every move for years. She may have recorded something for what she found. Oh yeah. Then now we have to go back to the Faye and Co. law offices. It's funny looking at this room. It seems so normal. I don't imagine a murder took place here. Oh look, there's a blood spot. <laughs> Mr. Grossberg said there would be clues. Maybe I should have another look. You look in the files. In the files. Wrong files. His desk. Perfectly clean as always. The only thing that's missing is. Mia. All the cases the chief have worked on are filed. They're in alphabetical order. Let's take a look. Which file should I look at? You probably want to look for R. So, J to S. What was the thing? Well, we're looking for files that... DL6 and 7. So it might be... Oh, so it might be A to I then, yeah. Yeah, A to I. Let's see if there's... There's A record in this file that catches my eye. A. Hey. A. B. C. D. E. F. G. H. I. J. K. L. M. N. O. P. Q. R. S. T. U. V. W. X. Y. Z. 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 Z.
That's called crying. No. You're crying no. again! <laughs> uh, Grossberg. And you present the um, clippings, I think. Probably. Bonk. Bonk. Found this in Miss Files. So she was investigating Red White, as expected. Well, if you wanted to challenge him, you could present this in court. Not a bad idea. Cool. I guess go to Red White then. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, aren't you persistent? Sorry, but this is I love doing ask. his voice. Mr. Lawyer, I really hate having to repeat myself. But it seems the message has not yet penetrated your thick skull. Stop bothering me. If you try my patience further, I fear a nasty accident may occur. It will be my punch again. You skipped my fucking sentence. You did. You bitch. Present, present the news clip. No, because then he might take it. He won't. No, fine. Mm, Mia left me. I'd better make this one count. Mr. White. This is it, this. this. This is what catapults into the next trial, by the way. It's an article describing the... Of a politician. The blank. <laughs> uh, the blank. He was embezzling secret government funds. Then, one day, word got leaked to the press. Very next day, he took his own life. And this concerns me how? I found this article in Mia's office. Miss Mia. She had a file filed. <laughs> filed filled with articles like this. Every one of them was labeled with a single word. White. Mr. White, I know what you did to this politician. You blackmailed him. You blackmailed him. You spied on him. You were blackmailing him. Blackmail! Not just him either. You were threatening and coercing hundreds of others. You were rolling in all of the... Cases. That me investigated. This company is built on blackmail. I'm right, aren't I? What a bizarre accusation, Mr. Long. What is it that you should be doing now, investigating me? No, no, no. I think not. You should be searching for the one who killed Miss Mia. I did. Secretary's office, hello. Mr. Wrong will be leaving now. Yes, sir. I'll send someone right away. Wait a second, Mr. White. You right? You're absolutely right. I should be looking for the killer now. And actually... I've done better. I found him. He's sitting right in front of me. Just what are you insinuating? Mia was onto you. She was keeping tabs. For this reason, you had April May tapping her phone. Then, Mia was murdered. And all documents about you, mis you mysteriously disappeared. So the culprit would be... Even a child could work it out, Mr. White. You did it. What is with his eyebrows? Beep. Secretary's office. We won't be needing an escort from Mr. Wrong. Instead, please connect me to the public prosecutor's office. Of course, sir. One moment, please. White, that's you. What are you doing calling me at a time like this? Hello, Chief Prosecutor. I've changed my mind. I want to testify tomorrow. What's this about? The Mia Fey case. I witnessed the murder, you see. And thus, as a very important witness, I'd like to testify. What? Why now? I thought you said you didn't want to go to court. Quite a tune! I told you I changed my mind, didn't I? Oh, and one other thing. Send the police over here right away. The man is standing right in front of me. He looks dazed, but could be violent. What? What man? Are you even listening? The executioner. The hatchet man. The liquidator. The killer. Your man. <laughs> what? Mr. White, this isn't another one of those. Chief Prosecutor, I do not believe you're in the position to freely offer your opinions to me, correct? I'm telling you to send the police. Now. Beep. Did I not tell you, Mr. Wrong? You are a mere lawyer. As was Miss Mia. A day. I'll point the finger at you, and you will be tried as a Miss Mia's killer. The case is as good as settled. No lawyer of any worth will defend you. I'll have friends in the local lawyers association, you see. You'll be given a lawyer so stupendously inept that they make you even you look com com competent. 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 Dude, he's saying so many words, it is I, fiddling with my brain. I feel faint. <laughs> Detective Gumshoe reporting, sir. 
Ah, butts. Harry butts. Harry, Harry butts, sorry. <laughs> right, actually. Phoenix right. And my friend's name is Larry. Oh, right. Sorry, pal. <laughs> butts was that murderer, right? Detective Gumshoe. I present to you the man who killed Miss Mia Fey. But what? We take this despicable human in being into custody. Farewell, Mr. Wrong. I do like this guy. He's, a, he's a good... September 8th. September 8th. 3.30th. 3.30th. The Tension Center. Oh, Visitors World. <laughs> uh, uh oh. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh oh. Can't believe it's only been a day since the first trial. My trial begins tomorrow. That's gonna set a trap for me. The prosecution will be in it. Uh, of course, Edgeworth included. That attorney was assigned to me by the state yesterday. I refused. I had an idea. Right! <laughs> Mr. Right! Oh, Maya. Great. They let you out of detention. Yeah, apparently the rooms look exactly the same, just from the other side. I don't know, it's weird. Just now, yes, it's all thanks to you. <laughs> now I'm afraid we've switched places. What? You mean you... Oh yeah, why are you behind the jail for us? I explained what had happened to Maya. I don't believe it. How many people does that mean he doesn't... Look? But <laughs> fucking dude, I can't express how much red and white is fucked with my brain with his words. My sister, and now you. This has gone too far, Mr. Wright. Please tell me, is there anything I can do? Um. Well, can we break out of here? Family in court. <laughs> All right, you can meet my defense lawyer tomorrow. All right. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Leave it to me, I am my sister after all. Lordship runs in our blood. Wasn't it ghost powers that ran in your blood? I'd better run to the bookstore and pick up a copy of Wolf for Rookies. Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what? I'm kidding, it was a joke. No way! No, really, I was kidding, but thanks, it's good to know you're on my side. And there really isn't anything you can do for me anyway. But, but I can't just sit here and do nothing! I've got to give that man a piece of my fucking night! Gah! Gah! <laughs> super saying. Just a piece? Okay. Then, come to the trial tomorrow. Okay! I'll be there. I'll show them a thing or two. Or three or five. I don't know how to count. Times may change. Hit with a crime, it's the same old story. In fact, it's gotten worse. Lengthy court proceedings are no longer realistic. Beginning a few years ago, a limit of three days was put on initial court trials. Almost all finish in a day, and most with a guilty verdict. That's because of fucking Edgeworth. Hmm. I never thought I would end up in the defendant's chair myself for this case. I'm here! <laughs> I am here! It's <laughs> <laughs> <Some> fucking All Might. All Might! Texas. His punch in his brain he was like, Texas, smash! <laughs> With the true culprit appearing as a star witness. That's zip. I don't know what you're Tomorrow talking it's about. Me or him. <laughs> what are you talking about? Did right hand and left hand. And I know that we're not exactly at the 20 minute mark, but do we want to continue this next time? I suppose so. Let me save. Good, good call. Continue on to the trial next time. September 9th, 9.52 a.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby Number 1. Next time! Next time. <laughs>